Okay, so I have a Samsung Galaxy S6 here, and this will work for a S6 Active as well. Now the problem is your phone is uh, perfect, uh, perfectly black, it won't turn on, maybe it's in a boot loop. Uh, maybe you see like a blue flashing like here or some lights down here, but that's all you get on the screen. I'm going to tell you several steps what you can do to get your uh, S6 back up and running. So first thing you want to do is go ahead and grab your computer or laptop. You want to go ahead and plug it in like this. Pop that in here. And let me just go ahead and power off the phone. Now, the first thing you want to do is this. Okay, so basically the phone is powered off. What you can do is you can hold, press and hold the power button and the volume down button at the same time. Power button, volume down button. Press and hold it for about 10, 15 seconds. And hopefully you can hear your phone vibrate or um, you can hear it turn on. If not, you want to do the next step. This time, what you want to do is the same thing, except instead of holding the volume down button, you want to hold the volume up button, okay? So power button and volume up button this time. That's it. The same thing. Hold it for 10, 15 seconds, and hopefully you hear or you feel it vibrate or hear the, uh, the sound pop on. If it works, great. If not, follow to the next step. Next step, what you basically want to do is you want to just go ahead and go into the reco recovery mode. And how you do that is you got to shut down the phone, power off. And what we're going to do here is we're going to, we're going to hold the volume up key, the power button and the home key simultaneously. Okay. One, oh, you got to plug, plug this out right here like this. Make sure you take this out. So it's up power home. One, two, three. Hold it, keep holding it. Hold it till you see the little Android guy right there and you can see that now it says system, installing system update. Give this a second. Okay, now once you're into the recovery menu, what you want to do is, it's already on the default, it says reboot system now. Go ahead and simply click on the power button and let it reboot and hopefully that will bring up your S6 or your S6 active. Now that, that, that doesn't work, what we're going to do next is we are going to wipe the cache partition, which is not, which is not a factory reset, so you're not going to lose any data. Okay, so what you want to do, I'm going to shut my phone back off, and I'm going to do the same thing this time. What I'm going to do is, again, I'm going to hold up the up volume, the power button, and I'm going to hold down the uh, home button simultaneously. Okay, one, two, three. And I'm going to keep holding it until I see the Android guy again. There he is. Now I'm going to let go. I'm going to wait till it goes back into the system recovery option mode. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to go down to where it says wipe cache partition. So use the volume down bar to scroll down. So I'm going to click one, two, three. four, five is wipe cache partition, not wipe data factory reset. Okay. That'll basically clean your entire phone. It, it, it'll, but it'll do, it'll erase everything on your phone. So wipe cache partition, and then you're going to go ahead and click on the power button to select it. And then once it comes to this menu, you go ahead and reboot system. Now this is on the default. So press the power button again. Give the second to reboot and hopefully your phone is back up. Now it's Okay, the other thing that we want to do is make sure your phone is powered off. And this time I want you to hold the volume down button, the power button, and the home button simultaneously. Okay, so one, two, three. I'm going to hold it. 
Now this screen will pop up and you can let go. Now it says volume up, continue, volume down, cancel. Okay, what you can do here is you can go and click on volume down. Basically, it's cancel and restart phone. So volume down. And hopefully that will boot up your phone. If not, here's the next step. If not, I have one more suggestion what you can do. And it's possible that your power button may be uh, may have an issue on it. Uh, I had this problem with a lot of the previous other Samsung phones as well. So basically what you want to do is Oops, let me just shut this phone off for now. Okay, phone is off now. What you wanna do is you want to bang the power button. This is called the smack method, okay? So I got a book here and I'm gonna kinda of like smack it right on the power button, guys. Bang this like a few times. Go back and power on your phone. See if that works. If that doesn't, go ahead and bang it a little bit harder, guys. Bang it harder. Try it again. If it doesn't work, go ahead into the power button and keep playing with the power button because something is jammed in there or something. Just keep pushing it up and down and then just put the power on, see if it comes up. And the chances are one of these methods is going to work for you guys. If you guys have any questions or anything, just comment below. And that's pretty much it. Thanks. Bye-bye.